So let's go ahead and write this horizontally. So 2 divided by x plus 3 divided by y. I mean 3 plus y. Yeah. 3 divided 3 over y divided by negative 5 over x plus 7 over y. Sorry guys, I'm a little bit tired. Okay. Let's go ahead and find common denominators here. We have x and y. Okay. Um, what I'm missing here is a y. So I'm going to multiply top and bottom by y, 2y. Here I'm missing an x plus 3x divided by, it's again x and y. What I'm missing here is a y and a y. So negative 5y. What I'm missing here is an x and x plus 7x. Okay, now I can go ahead and take the reciprocal. Okay, um, I can make it into one long fraction. See the x and y simplifies. So 2y plus 3x over negative 5y plus 7x. Okay, if I want to make it pretty, it'd be 3x plus 2y over 7x minus 5y. And guys, that's my final answer. I can't really do a restriction here, okay? Because if we have x, 7x minus 5y, we cannot distinguish what x can be and y can be because it's not factored. We can't factor it, and you can say this entire thing can equal zero, but we can't. Sorry, it's starting to rain. Hope everybody's safe. Bye bye. I hope you understand this lesson. If not, you need to come to yes. What's the T word? No, not, not T Rex, not that kind of T, not dinosaurs, but yes, you need to come to what's the T word? Not TP, okay? Nope, not TP. What's the T word? Tutoring. Yes, we need to come to tutoring, okay? Bye.